Francesca Woodman was born in Denver, Colorado on April 3rd, 1958. Her father, George Woodman, described, These children grew up in a household of artists, filled with artist friends, art always before their eyes, art talk in their ears. Much of Woodman's work was produced as a student at the Rhode Island School of Design in Providence, where she studied from 1975 through 1978. Her entire body of work was created in the short span of eight years. Many of her photos appear timeless due to her choice of background, atmosphere, and clothing. According to Corey Keller, curator of photography at the San Francisco Museum of Modern Art, Woodman's use of film contrasts the cool slickness of digital and embraces tactility and decay in a very sensual and seductive way. In September of 1980, Francesca Woodman attempted suicide and was hospitalized. She was released after being treated with therapy and medication. Her work has since been featured in many galleries, including the Guggenheim. Her image is often ghostly or partially obscured, which creates a mysterious, disturbing, and often intimate effect. I relate to her use of self-portraiture to explore relationships, sexuality, body image, isolation, and confusion surrounding identity. I appreciate how her work depicts the feminine body in ways that are neither modest nor especially provocative. In doing so, Francesca Woodman often creates a middle ground between modesty and provocation in her work surrounding the female body.